Welcome to season three, bitch. So yeah, right. um, it is I, Lord Heroicus, and I am here with Tato. Uh, Venom was Venom was unfortunately run over by a radioactive bear and eaten. Yeah, we will. So he, uh, he'll return next week when he's uh, mm -hmm. he's healed. He's got very yeah. good health insurance. Yeah. Um. Fun fact: This is the fifteenth um, episode to be recorded for season three, and it's the first to air. So nice. Oh yeah. I guess. <clears throat> and this episode is going to be on. No, don't tell me you forgot already. No, I was I was t I was passing it to you. Oh, oh, I see. Yes. um... Elm Street, A Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, this is... Fuck, what's the Don't name? Tell me you forgot. <laughs> it's, uh, it's like, is it... No, I'm like, it's, is this the Dream three. Master or the Dream yeah, Child? Yeah, 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 Dream... It's Dream Master, I believe. Yeah, Dream Child, I think, is after. Too many dream... things. Hang on, I'm up to my files. All right. <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah. A nightmare. Yeah. I mean, everyone can see the thumbnail, like, which is a change. I decided I, I've already edited at this point three other episodes. And oh, I gotcha, gotcha. If there's no footage, I just put the thumbnail as, like, the backdrop of the video. It just looks neater. Mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah. <laughs> People think we're fucking idiots at this point. <laughs> but, yeah. So, um, first thing is, uh, the Elm Street theme that plays, like, at the beginning and then, like, randomly throughout the movie, it's fantastic. I love it. It's yeah, just... It's a banger. Mm. It goes really hard. The fancy music opening and shit, like, uh, for some reason I thought this was, it was parodying, like, a Bond movie opening. <laughs> um, and my... Th third note here is um tuesday night which is the name of the actress i forget who she plays her um, name is tuesday yeah tuesday oh, night night spelled like you know a knight in armor yeah okay um that name just looks like a porn star name to me uh, yeah i was about to say <laughs> but it's it's not that's just I, I it's just a stage name i assume i'm i assume that's not her actual name but i could be wrong yeah. Uh, Tuesday, if you're watching, can you just confirm that for us? That'd be real nice. Yeah. Um, Tweet at us or something. <laughs> I was completely confused at the beginning witnessing this, the the girl just like. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. She's like walking. She's walking down the street, and the the little girls are singing, right? Yeah, and then okay, she, it's coming she back mentioned. In a little bit. She mentions Freddy, and I'm like, "You're a new character. How the hell do you know who Freddy is?" And then it's like, <laughs> yeah. you you learn a little later. It's just uh, Kristen from the last yeah, she movie. She got recasted, and I, I was really yeah. confused about that too. I was like, like I think like halfway through the movie, I realized I was like, "What? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah." Because I, I uh, remembered, I, I was like, "It's not her, is it?" And then I was like, "Okay, I guess it is." Yeah. I only got it, like, once I saw Kincaid and the other guy, which, I don't know if the other guy, I forget. I have it written somewhere. I think yeah. it's, I think um, it's Joey is the other guy. Uh, um, because yeah. I, I have written, yeah, I, I have notes of, like, who dies at the start, yeah. and Joey's, Joey's one of them, so it's gonna yeah, be him. Joey. I don't know if he was recast. Kincaid, I, I, don't I, I think, think that's was. What, yeah, it looks like the same dude. Um, but yeah, it's just, I didn't recognize Joey. Mm. And, but it's yeah. like, as soon as I, they said Kincaid, I'm like, oh, it's, it's yeah, the... Kincaid's my, Kincaid's my man. Yeah. Um, yeah, so they're like talking at school and then like, right as they leave, you just see like these deep, huge scratches in the locker. I'm like, D -d -d does nobody see this shit? Why does nobody ever see like is it exclusively... it's the classic nightmare uh the classic nightmare 
thing of like, is this really happening or what? Is it like in his mind, in their mind, or is Freddy just like yeah? But somehow nobody sees it though. They walk yeah. away, so it's like it's like Freddy got it all set up like fucking two he seconds him. late. <laughs> uh, but it's just like what I mean is like, is it exclusive to the ones who are he's after? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it seems like nobody else sees this shit. Unless yeah, they get roped I, I mean, into that it somehow. To be the case, I think. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so eventually, Kristen realizes like Freddy's coming back, and the others just kind of like, "Nah, you're you're just crazy." Like, even though they just literally dealt with this shit. Which yeah, I in assume... the last movie, it's like, "No, he's fine. He's not back." Be, yeah, I think I think you should take a few precautions just in case. Mm -hmm. um, but no, they just don't. Uh, my favorite thing, so... Kincaid's the first one to go. Um, he wakes up uh, in a dream of the car... Uh, yeah, the... Um, the What is that called? Car junkyard, whatever. Yeah, the junkyard. We'll just and he's just... The first thing he says is, This ain't my dreamland. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking yeah. <sighs> Fucking love. And then, like, so Freddy's good. grave opens, and his skeleton yeah. just reformed. Yeah. He, he has a literal demonic has, anime character yeah. transformation. He has such a cool entrance in this movie, though. It's so cool. Someone should take it, though, and just, like, cut it at some point and literally just make a, a Sailor Moon transformation. And then no, it just switches good. back to the movie when it's done. Yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, like he's totally dead in the third one, and he's just like, "Nah, I'm, I'm just gonna no. die." No, I'm not. Yeah, he's just like, mm. "No, thanks." I, I would. I'm surprised dead. with um, he had like, like we talked in the third one. Like there was a lot of like religious overtones, or I don't know if that's yeah, the correct yeah. word, but you get what I mean. Like, the, uh, like I'm yeah. surprised they should have just made it so this was set three days later and. Fre Freddy just keeps making jokes like he's Jesus <laughs> that or something. Been so funny. Yeah. Back from the dead, bitch. Throw the stone away, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That would have been good. But yeah. Takes care of Kincaid and we get the first one-liner. One down, two to go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> His one-liners in this movie are great. Yeah. Um, how does he kill him again? He just stabs him, I think. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. He's kind of unimaginative in the killings. Yeah, He's focusing more on the one-liners. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Understandably. Uh, yeah, I'll, he has a reputation to keep up. I think I'll jump around a bit after this next bit, but I just this right. is just too juicy to, <laughs> to <laughs> not... <laughs> this is too juicy to skip over. So, uh, we immediately, like, cut to Joey's room. He's like, Listening to music on his bed or something. Oh my god! Yeah. The the his girl in the bed. post. His water yeah. bed. I made. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is this is the second time someone's died in a water bed in this series. I think. I think so. Yeah. Uh, possibly. He likes water beds. Um. So yeah, the girl in Joey's poster somehow warps into the water bed and loses yeah. her bikini in the progress. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he's thinking about her like, oh, I wish she was real. And then she does become a real. And he's like, wait a minute. <laughs> uh, yeah, the mere presence of nudity signals Joey is moments from death. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, Freddy like takes him, drowns him in the bed. And uh, yeah. I lost this for a wet dream. I fucking <laughs> lost right? it. So yeah, cool. I think I did too. I'm glad I was muted when we were watching. It was so good. Oh, uh, um, yeah. He also, Joey's also really stupid because, like, as soon as he sees that, he just doesn't question. He's like, oh, wait, I want to, where's the girl? Because I think yeah. she, like, comes up to, the, like, the surface of the water bed and then she swims away or something. Yeah. Like that, yeah. And he's just like, where'd she go? Instead of, you know, why is she real? Yeah, it's like, pop off to the side of the bed, unzip the bed, get her out. Yeah. Refill the bed. Wink, yeah. wink. 
Uh, yeah, well, I may as well just go for this one last one. Uh, <laughs> uh, Freddy's um, most terrifying form yet as the school nurse Freddy. <laughs> I saw that and I'm like, okay, this nurse has a really strong jawline. Yeah. And, just, and then I'm like, wait a minute. That's him. That's Freddy. <laughs> That's the man. The man of the hour. And I'm surprised we didn't get a uh, a revisit, considering he has a needle in this, to have a revisit of the needle hand Ugh, yeah. from the last movie. Oh, God, I hate that death. <laughs> um. <laughs> but yeah. I want to draw some blood. <laughs> oh, that was one good. Liners are, is one-liners keep on coming in this movie. Oh, yeah. We just need an entire movie where it's just a, there's a probably slaughter. like a compilation. Well, no, I mean a movie oh, that's oh, just, oh. just a slaughter of everyone in the town, and ev- there's just a one-liner like every ten every, seconds. <laughs> every citizen gets a one-liner to themselves. That would be great. Yeah. <laughs> I think they're and doing like, a remake. The movie- actually, if they should do that in the remake. Yeah, there's. I heard. Um, I heard there was. I'm not sure. Yeah. Ha, ha, I, wait. I might be thinking of Friday the Thirteenth. Maybe both. I yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. Um, the thing is, I think Heather. God, Lincoln. what the fuck? Yeah. yeah. She does want to make another one. Oh, I, I guarantee. Fair. I guarantee you. Um, fuck. What's what's Freddy's actor's name? Uh, Robert England. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure he'd be down. I mean. He, yeah. He's still acting. He was just in Stranger Things 4. Yeah, so. I watched a podcast with him uh, on it. And he, he seems like a really cool dude. Yeah. Which, uh... That was so delicious to see when there was a actual Freddy Krueger reference in that same season. Yeah. Uh, and then it's... It's it's it's, it's probably the only reason why the person that made the reference didn't get to meet his character, because they've been... You look really fucking familiar. <laughs> um, it's also a funny implication that there is someone... That there is a Robert England in the Stranger Things universe, and then there's someone who looks like him, but old. Yeah. In the- <laughs> it's like the... um Oh, God, what is it? It's like the Kevin Bacon thing, and... um Oh, well, First Class isn't fucking MCU, but Kevin Bacon in the MCU... Was he in the holiday special? Did you watch the Guardians holiday special? No, I haven't. No. Oh, dang. They literally just kidnapped Kevin Bacon, like the actor. Oh. It's really funny. You should check it out if you ever get the chance. Hmm. Um, yeah, but then again, I don't think he's in other movies. He was in the X-Men First Class. As the yeah, 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 yeah. That's, That's what I was thinking of. I forgot that wasn't MCU. For I mean, reason. technically... That's part of the MCU now, yeah, but it's now. a separate universe. <laughs> and, yeah. Um, Shit. <sighs> Let's see here. Oh. Do, 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 do. So we have a dream where Chris, like the new protagonist, um, her mom's very nice. After seeing like she's having trouble sleep, she decides to drug her own daughter yeah, so she'll go to yeah. sleep. Uh, <laughs> He's great. like, oh, you can't sleep. Let me just drug, drug you. That's that's that'll I'll help. Yeah. And so then, um, I actually uh, when she runs upstairs because she like runs away. She's like, Mom, what the hell? And then she like runs upstairs because they're at their dinner table or whatever. And Mm -hmm. when she runs upstairs, I really like the way that's filmed. Like when she runs into her room and it's like fucking frantically, like it's like a, uh, it's like a one take thing, I think Mm -hmm. where they're just like going all around the room, like kind of like, uh, Oh, like getting disoriented, kind of like to portray like how she's feeling. I I really liked how that was done. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, uh, it's a thing. That was the one thing I do remember really well because I really, I really liked that. Mm. Yeah, and the thing she says right before, it's like her mom's yeah. like, why, "Why don't you, like why don't you eat?" And she's just like, "I I just saw two of my friends get killed on the same day. I'm kind of it's kind of ruined my appetite." And her mom just, "Oh, you're just tired." Like, 
god, this <laughs> fucking boomer. He's such an asshole. But yeah, her dream, she dreams she's at the beach, and uh, everything's fine till a Brady shark swims on land. Wait, what the f I don't remember that. What the hell? How'd you miss that? Yeah, she she's just like chilling on the beach. I forget if she's just on a towel. I or, might have went to the like bathroom. A, or like um That was dang it. I missed the yeah. best part. Fuck. That's yeah. really funny. Hold on, I need to look I need to look up what this looks like. Real quick. Ready, shark. No, not some guy named No, not a shark named Freddy. Let me see if I can find it for you. No, I got it. <laughs> Alright. You found it? Uh, I think. <clears throat> so. No, it's not showing up for some reason. <clears throat> That's unfortunate. I don't know how I missed that. What yeah. It must have been when you walked away, I guess. But anyway. Yeah, I think I, I think I went to the bathroom is what it was. So I forget if she's like on a towel or on like a a beach chair or something. She's in like a a bikini and like she's got like a like I don't know, a beach skirt. I don't know what the fuck they're called. Um and she's just like having a nice dream of being at a nice beach, and then there's a shark that pops up and it's literally I forget if it's wearing his clothes or if it's just colored <laughs> to look like him it swims goes it swims right through the sand like all you see is the shark fin really. it goes directly into a sand castle explodes and then instantly freddy's just standing where the sand castle was it's he knows how to make an entrance <laughs> he knows how to make an entrance that's so and, fucking and, and funny this, and this literally happens in the span of, like, ten seconds. It's so fast. That's probably why I didn't notice it. It just happened so fast. Um, but oh, yeah. man. That's really funny. So she she sees that. Um, he takes a moment to put sunglasses on. And then... I do remember Chris, that. Yeah, Kristen falls through some quicksand. Um, somehow she has a full, you know, outfit on at this point. I guess Freddy wants to give her dignity of not dying in, in a bikini at the beach. Like, uh, and then the most horrifying, creepy thing Freddy says in this entire fucking thing, um, Alice, come to daddy. Uh, actually, I think that's a little bit later. I think my notes just had us break. Yeah, it must have been, yeah, because Alice is Yeah, like, I think you're right. Yeah, my bad. Well, whatever. <laughs> it's like another dream. And it's just like, why did he say that so seductively? Yeah, he didn't to need to do that. Someone That's who's probably... Girl. Yeah, she's probably 17. Ready? That's, yeah. See, I know people don't like the remake because they made him, like, like explicitly a pedophile, but, like... If you watch the movies, he's already kind of like sus. Yeah. Like, I don't. I don't think that's the issue with that movie. Yeah. I think it's just a bad movie. I think it's just a bad remake. But um, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and I. My problem with the beginning of my notes is I I don't know who people's names are right away, so yeah. I just call them. Um, there's a scene at the diner at the beginning and yeah, yeah yeah i think i remember okay so alice's friend i guess like the... oh god the the nerdy one i think I, she was I, like a nerdy one i don't know uh didn't it was like a no. black girl no no it wasn't her it no. was her color oh, okay, different one. oh yeah i remember her yes yeah she kind of like bounces <laughs> up and like oh these two hot guys just came in i'm i'm stealing your table i'm like yeah what? What I forget. Want? I forget who she was, but like because she is horny, she she must have been marked for death. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I love the new protagonists get force fed the entire history of the franchise in twenty seconds flat. Hell yeah! <laughs> Gotta catch them up. Yeah. Um, uh, 
Fucking damn. <laughs> <clears throat> and, um... um oh. Yeah, so... Alice's friend, Sheila, she's a nerd, uh, made a device yeah, okay. that scares cockroaches with sound, um... I figure, like, this will definitely have a use later. Oh, God, yeah. Like, it's so obvious. Yeah, um, yeah. it's... it's the Chekhov's gun of Chekhov's guns. And then we get to a point where, um, I guess at this point, or maybe it's a little later, uh, yeah, she ends up getting sucked into a dream by, I, I don't know if it's Alice or Yeah, Chris, I think it's Chris. Alice. Or yeah. no, it's Chris. Yeah, yeah, it is Chris. Yeah, I think Chris dies a little bit later. I... I actually have no additional notes on Chris, so I don't know. Maybe that's what I maybe that's what I missed. Maybe or something. Um. Actually, yeah, she no. Gets, actually, she no. Gets... She, no, she dies a little. She dies later because she she has she like transfers the power or something. Oh yeah, that's right. Anyway, um. Yeah, she gets sucked into that dream. She takes her into the dream because that's yeah. She's a dream master. That's her. That's her thing. And the dream just is literally them at school and yeah. her oh, in, her her pen starts dripping blood and for some reason she smears the blood all over the book i'm like but why yeah why'd you do that that's like clearly not normal uh, now your uh, book's bloody. and then freddie gives sheila the bad suck yeah it's true Oh, oh yeah, that's no okay. I do remember that. Yeah, he yeah. fucking he fucking. What does he say? Yeah. Does he say give daddy a kiss? I don't remember. I think he says something to that effect, and then he just probably he smooches her and sucks her life force out, and she's yeah. all skeletal. Yeah, and then like they wake up. I like, like that she's, effect too. Yeah, it's she's really carted good. off, and. It's like, what 17-year-old has fatal asthma? And I'm just like, wait, wait a damn second. Hey. Plenty of people <laughs> have fatal asthma at any age. <laughs> it just doesn't Money make nightmare. sense. Yeah, that doesn't <laughs> make sense. Um... Oh, gosh. Uh, yeah, doesn't, doesn't Alice, like, freak out when uh when she wakes up or whatever and, and, and they cart her yeah. away? Yeah. He's like, I, I took her in with me or something. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> again, I, I got some incomplete notes here. I just my next thing just says Rick gets beaten up by Invisible Freddy. Yeah. Alice then wakes yeah. up and screams so loudly the classroom windows explode oh, in the yeah. real world. Yeah. Well, sure he no tips. He has he has the power. Yeah, but it's like uh, I I would have I'd have been really suspicious of how this girl managed to scream so loud that all the yeah. windows shattered get fucking inwards, Charles Xavier on think. the phone yeah it was inwards I'm pretty sure yeah just yeah it made no sense uh, yeah. and I have to say nobody in this town gives a fuck when there's four funerals in a, yeah in, the, the, the in none of these movies no one gives a shit they're just like meh just can you know it's it like great. And you just know, it's like, all of the parents, like, they're denying it, but they know. They know they, Freddy's they know bad. Absolutely like, know. Yeah, well, you see, we killed him. Like, eh. It's like, no, we, we killed him. Like, okay. Sure, pro, He's sure right pro, here, pro, but no. okay. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> they're like, nah, we, we took care of him already. You, ca you guys can do it. <laughs> yeah, you got this <laughs> you gotta You gotta pull your own weight. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Yeah, a bunch of... <laughs> Fucking boomers. Liberals. Uh, <laughs> I mean, yeah, boomers. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> um, let's see. What's after that? Uh, Alice goes into a movie theater and, well, has a, a dream that uh, she gets sucked into the screen, which it was a, a interesting thing. <laughs> and then. Um, she gets waited on in the diner by her elderly self. Freddy comes up. If the food won't kill you, the service surely will. <laughs> oh, like, Those one-liners on point. Yeah. 
He's just and then pulling them I out. Think, I think <clears throat> she, yeah, she's in like a, a dream at this point, and she drags a couple others with her. So yeah. we get the uh, the the gym girl, who I yeah yeah yeah. yeah. Where the fuck are... I didn't even write her damn name. <laughs> oh, Debbie. Debbie. Yeah, uh, Debbie. I do remember. Yeah. Yes. Um, Freddy is a very bad gem spotter. He's not. Yeah, he's not. He's not. He doesn't... <laughs> oh, yeah. He's not very good. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is your favorite scene uh -huh. where her, her, yep. her arms turn into cockroach arms and her... Uh -huh. The rubber glove hands dropped. To the I floor. I oh, that that was okay. You gotta admit though, the, the rubber hands it looks, dropping. Yeah. It's so goofy. <laughs> yeah, it looks really goofy. the The transformation is actually like really good. Like the practical effects are really really good. But like, yeah, it's gross. It's but it's so supposed gross. to be. It's yeah, it's it's horrible. That's like the worst fucking way you can. She like turns into a roach. That's what happens. Yeah, and I she thought turns at this into point. A giant roach. I thought at this point, ah, this is where that sound device comes in. They're going to show up and like, ah, oh, shit, you're already turned into a roach. We, you, you can't be saved. Just turn the thing on and kill her right there. Yeah. Put her out of her misery, but yeah. nope. They should have uh, been. Yeah, that would have been good. Uh, yeah. Alice ends up getting stuck in a loop, which the first time it happened, I thought I had like clicked my keyboard. Yeah, and yeah. I was like, what the movie. The <laughs> or it like, started... I've had I've had movies where I've sat and watched them and they just spontaneously skip a few scenes back. What the heck? It like I don't know. It's just something Weird. that breaks. Yeah, maybe, uh, maybe it's like a scratches on your CD or something. Or your yeah, disc, something like that. Yeah. Yeah, a poorly created one. Sometimes yeah, I had yeah. um off topic, but usually I don't have issues with DVDs and stuff. Mm -hmm. Um. But there was this thing, and I it must have been a widespread issue. Mm -hmm. Um, it was a mid two thousands release of Ghostbusters. Oh, I don't know if it was a double pack or not. I want to assume it was. It was like the box was green. It had uh, yeah, I think I've seen it. that. I think I've seen that. And in the first movie, it plays up to a scene where they're like they're. Uh, they're explaining to Winston like how the ghost trap machine works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's the whole the whole Twinkie thing, and like it stops right there, and, and it just it would not play like the next like three four minutes of the movie. It would just yeah, skip. That's weird. So it was so frustrating. I could never see what that little bit was, and it's yeah. it's crucial because that's the point where Dana gets possessed. Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's kind of an important part. Yeah, so it's just like weird. It, sk it skipped that. <laughs> I never got to see it, and then it's like the next time you see Dana, she's just in like this gold yeah. dress with real sexy makeup. Like, what the I'm like, fuck just happened? I I think I missed something here. Yeah. <laughs> Why is she horny now? <laughs> but <Mama> yeah. Just <laughs> but yeah, that's like the worst DVD issue I've had, and I assumed something was like this, but it's simply. Alice is just caught in, like, a loop because Freddy's a dick. Yeah. So, the loop it just involves, um, she's got, I don't know, her boyfriend or something. Oh, damn. They get in the truck, they drive off, and they just end up back at the start, and they're like, we gotta go! And they just, after, like, the fucking, this happening, like, 12 times, she's suddenly like, huh, feels like we're going in circles. That's literally what they say. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, um, oh, but yeah, I forgot to write that, um, Alice at this point, um, cause she realizes, uh, the others are like falling asleep or something or Freddy's like out and about. Mm -hmm. She, um, takes sleeping pills and then gets dressed tactically as possible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she fucking. Oh, I think it's because like, she I'm woke. Oh, she woke up at some point, I guess. Yeah, and I think... yeah, she I think it was put her ass kicking outfit on. Yeah, and yeah, before she got dressed or whatever, um, Debbie ended up walking into a jump. Well, 
yeah, I guess a giant roach motel, and then Freddy got like even bigger, yeah. or she got smaller. Yeah. I and think he, just, he got bigger. He he literally just yeah, crushes he just, her he just and crushes her. Thing. It's like, yeah, damn. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think after... I think I think something we also missed was um, I think after. Yeah, after Debbie was turned into a cockroach, uh, Alice tried to ram her, or he tried to ram Freddy, apparently, and she collided with a tree, is what I'm reading here. I just had the Wikipedia article pulled up, so I oh, don't know. Oh, I see. So that's why she woke up. Then she had to run yeah, home and yeah, yeah. get she, her sleeping yeah. pills. That's what happened. <clears throat> um, yeah, because uh, I think she... she cause I think it's because Dan's still in the dream, so she needed to get back in. Yeah, um, that's I don't know what window I'm referring to in this note, but it's just she does a running kick through a window, and her body somehow changes direction mid-jump. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, she manages thing. to get Dan woken up safely, and then she proceeds to the boss fight with Freddy. Hell yeah. Um, and it, Yeah, basically it was a boss fight. <laughs> yeah. Her, her, her attacks were frame-perfect, but yeah, Freddy was clearly using hacks. Yeah, yeah, so, it was. Pretty unfair. He's a cheater. Uh, this is actually... We, this is the first... Um, unless it was in that few minutes I missed. This is the first time Freddy says bitch in the movie. <laughs> um, And I, I missed a note on this. Uh, There's some lore that comes in that, like... The person who is able to bring people into dreams is guarding a positive dream gate while Freddy... You know, this lore, random new lore dump in this movie is yeah. he's guarding the negative gate. Mm -hmm. And so Alice, having gotten the power from Chris before she died, uh, is the new guardian. And Freddy just like, I've been guarding my gate for a long time, bitch. Uh, she uh, uses the cockroach device and it vaporizes like a hole straight through Freddy's chest destroys his heart, but yeah. it does nothing. So it's like, yeah, there was no Absolutely point not. to this thing. It was, yeah. <laughs> um, and then he says, "I am eternal," and I, I immediately recognize that because somebody used this. Um, I think it was, fuck, hang on. I think it was Anonymous. Is a he's a good, he makes. Uh, shit post videos on YouTube mm -hmm. with um, TF2. Ah, okay. Uh, I might have heard of them. Yeah, what is this called? Uh, Eternal Tipping. It's 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 a clip. Yeah, Anonymous. Um, it's they got heavy, and he's just like continuously tipping his fedora to a lady, <laughs> and it has using like this song someone synthesized. It's actually the clip of Freddy saying that line. That's funny. <laughs> it's just slowed down like slightly, so it sounds a little bit different. But like, I I know that fucking line. I've heard it. Yeah. Um, so I think that's so funny. It's TF2 video I've seen. Like fucking god, how long? How old is this? This is a seven year old video. I've, oh god. I heard that's really that. Funny, though. Yeah, I fucking lost my <laughs> shit at that. Um, and then. Alice holds up a piece of stained glass and it defeats yeah, Freddy. It def yeah. <laughs> I don't understand. Like, was there a cross on it or something? Here it says... Yeah, oh no, she 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 says the nursery rhyme, the Dream Master nursery rhyme or whatever, and then she and then she holds up the glass. So I guess the I guess nursery rhymes and, and stained glass are Freddy's weaknesses in this movie. Yeah. But uh, also... yeah, she does that. Go for it. Uh, there was a thing. So, like, as she's doing this, like, you're seeing, like, different, like, souls, I guess, writhe under Freddy's yeah. skin. And, um, yeah, that's a really reason, cool effect, too. Some reason... It this doesn't make sense, but I don't care. <laughs> yeah. For some reason... I mean, well, they already explained it, like, in previous movies. Like, he's absorbing Oh, yeah, that's them. right. He does have the things. In, but... In the, in the I I'd like to know why... Yeah, you couldn't recognize who it's supposed to be, but this one girl like rubs up and like you can see her tits, and I'm just like, yeah, you can. And I was like, did did they really why, have to do why, that? Why is this bitch naked? Why does why does this bitch soul have a have titties? <laughs> yeah, 
And uh, nobody dies after this point. Everything goes back to yep, normal. Everything is it's a happy ending. And that's a load of shit, because Freddy's still around somehow. Yep, somehow. <laughs> and that, uh... They're, uh... Yeah. Doesn't he fucking ex explode, too? Yeah, he explodes. Yeah, he, he fucking this... explodes. He, he, he has an uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi moment. It's just his yeah. clothes left behind. Yeah, that's right. That's right. His sweater and his hat are just on the ground. Yeah. But, like, I don't know. <laughs> they, yeah, yeah they, they literally destroyed this guy's real-life body. They destroyed his, him yep. in the and he's dream world. And not coming back, right? Ah, uh, well... Definitely I think not. there's like He's three more dead. sequels. Well, I don't know what you mean. Yeah, uh. How many more are there? Oh, uh, I shit. think there's like. Seven? Honestly? No, I Let's think there's. See. Or no, I think there's nine counting New Nightmare. Well, I'm talking to like in this line because New Nightmare oh. is like a. Kind of yeah, like, like a. a thing, right? It's like a spinoff sort of. Or like yeah. a parody? No, it's like it's the real world, and like they're yeah. I don't know if they're supposed to be remaking the first movie, but then like there's a dark force that like takes on the identity of Freddy Krueger. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think I assume six. I assume they took care of that one because like there wasn't a sequel to that, so that version like actually died. Yeah. Yeah. There's six. Not counting. New Nightmare, Freddy vs. Jason. Yeah, so, the um... There's six. Yeah. Considering this one is Elm Street 4, The Dream <clears throat> Master, and the next one is Elm Street 5, The Dream Child, who the <clears throat> fuck got pregnant in this movie? Also... Oh, I was reading this wrong. For a second, I thought it said 4 released on August 19th, 1989, and then... <laughs> Dream Child released August 11th, 1989. <laughs> like, wait, been, you released the fifth one before? <laughs> no, that's a year apart. Yeah. Um, yeah, so the next time we cover Young Street, it'll be the fifth one, and then we have Final Dream Nightmare Child. after that. Yeah. And then after that, New Nightmare, and then after that will be the last Elm Street one we cover, which is uh, okay. Freddy vs. Jason. Hell yeah. So y'all, you guys are not going to do the remake. <laughs> Yeah, don't blame we're, you. We're, we're gonna watch it out of curiosity, but because uh, of the like the pedophilic nature of yeah. it, where it's, it's not just like an offline here and there. It's like yeah, it's like a hard yeah, it's a whole like thing. yeah. Pro I'm not gonna give this like extra attention, but nah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's probably a good. If good you idea. at home want to watch it, uh, go for it. Yeah, you can. It's real gross, but you can go for it. Yeah. The collection yeah, I got was, was um, an eight-film collection at Walmart. It doesn't include the new one. It just has everything yeah. from the first up to Freddy vs. Jason. Gotcha. So, yeah. Yeah, I have the uh, I have the Friday... I have all the Friday movies and all the Chucky movies in that a little pack <clears> like that. <throat> um, but yeah, that was, that was the Dream Master. Yep. She was the Dream Master. And she definitely killed Freddy. He's definitely mm -hmm. dead. He exploded. How's he going to come back from that? Well, this is a theory. I don't, I have no oh, idea okay. what happens in the next way. movie. But, uh, what if, because the next one's called The Dream Child, what if Freddy magically made, uh, Alice uh, pregnant or something? I would and not then it's be, just, I think. Just like she has the kid, and she just assumes like, oh, it's probably just. Some oh guy. yeah, it's normal. Yeah. Yeah, some guy hooked up with at school, no biggie, and then it's just like the baby. Well, comes she is. Out and... She is dating Rick at the end of the movie. Oh yeah, fair enough. So she's probably gonna be like, hey. So we get to the point. The movie opens like she's she's yeah. going into labor. Baby yeah. comes out, and the first thing you hear is just like, "I'm back, bitch." <laughs> And it's just Freddy. It's just Freddy, but he's a baby. Like, like he's just a burnt baby with like. Fedora yeah. on. He comes out with his fedora on, and he has like a baby. I would love safe. that. I don't think that's what happens, but I I love that. That would that would be great though. We need this. Um, yeah, we need to redo that. All, 
Yeah. <laughs> And he just has like a baby face. I think there is something uh, like gloves. that. I think you're on the right track because it's been a while since I've. I don't know if I actually watched that. I know I watched the uh, Kill Con on Dead Meat, but I don't know if I actually watched it. But I think but you're yeah. on the right track. <clears throat> he needs to just have a a plaid diaper, a baby safe glove, and a small hat. <laughs> like baby that, he comes safe out glove. With that. Does he? Does his glove have like little little things over the blades? Yeah, just like little, <laughs> little plastic or, or things. Maybe, or maybe it's just entirely plastic. Yes, <laughs> the blades are just fake, like clearly yeah. fake instead of like fake, fake. Yeah. It's only when you fall asleep where he reaches his 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 full adult form. Yeah. So they that just keep him up all the time. Yeah, they just keep him up. Yeah. <laughs> See, that would be good. That would be great. I would watch that. Yeah, it's just you just get the two of them. They're at home. They're just like desperate. And then it just yeah, it just turns into like a slice of life thing where they have to keep them awake. <laughs> That'd be great. We um, that would be uh, so fun. So Warner Brothers, if you'd be so kind, I yeah, will yeah, buy. Yeah. I'll buy the rights to the franchise for um three dollars. Mm, I don't think they're gonna. I don't think they're gonna sell people. Or mm. I don't think they're gonna sell it to you for that. You might want to bring it up to maybe five, seven. Thirteen dollars, mm. and uh, Maybe. can we do if we can do the deal on a Friday? That'd be even better. Hell yeah! But anyways, uh, that is it. Yeah. Thank you for coming back to us for season three, everyone, and also you, Tato. You, you are the first guest host to be oh, part shit. of all three seasons Hell so yeah. far. So there's that. You're not the first guest host to record this season, though. Even though this is the first episode to be released, who is? I'm uh, curious. Death. There, I think it's the fourth episode is going to be a discussion on Halo. So Ooh. he was there for that. All right. See you in your dreams. <laughs>